3.3c, General Linear Equations, Distribute and Combine. Before we solve, we must simplify the left and right sides. One way to do this is to distribute then combine like terms. Remember, order of operations tells us to multiply, then add or subtract. And that distribute is multiply, and combine like terms is add or subtract. Therefore, we must distribute before we combine like terms. We will look at this in example one. Example one shows that we will have to distribute something on the first side. Remember, it is helpful to have a dotted line to make sure you do things to both sides of the equation. We will start by distributing on the first side. Two times three x is six x. Two times negative one is negative two. This equals four x plus six minus x. We have now done the multiplication step. At this point, we now need to see if we can combine any like terms. On the first side, neither of these terms are like terms, and therefore they cannot be combined. On the right side, we have a 4x and a negative x. These are like terms, which can be combined to make a 3x. The 6 does not combine, and therefore is written down. The other side is 6x minus 2. At this point, we now have variables on both sides. We must get the variables to one side of the equation. To do this, we move the smaller of the two variables. This happens to be the negative 3x. Remember, to move things from side to side, you do the opposite, meaning we would subtract 3x. We now get 3x minus 2 equals 6, because the 3x minus 3x becomes 0. We now have x isolated to one side, but we must now solve for the x by first adding or subtracting and then multiplying and dividing. We start by adding 2 to both sides. This allows us to get the term with the x alone. Once the term with the x is alone, we therefore can get rid of the number next to it using division. Remember, we use division because it's the opposite of multiplication. This results in x equals 8 thirds. And that is our answer to example 1. In example 2, there is distribution that must be completed on both sides of the equation. We start with the distribution. The reason we start with distribution is because if you look at the order of operations, or PEMDAS, you would start with what's inside parentheses. There is nothing to complete inside these parentheses. Therefore, you would move on to exponents, which there are none, and then multiply and divide. Remember that distributing is multiplying. Therefore, we have 3 times 2x is 6x. 3 times a positive 1 is plus 3, and the 9x comes straight down because it is not inside the parentheses where the distribution occurs. Next, we have 4 times x, which gives us 4x, 4 times positive 6, which gives us positive 24, and once again, the negative 20 comes straight down as it is not inside and therefore not part of the distribution. At this point, the distribution has been completed, but there are like terms that can be combined. When looking at the like terms, we can only highlight those that are on the same side of the equation. Remember, it is helpful to have a dotted line to keep the two sides separate, which means that these two x's can be combined 
and these two numbers on the other side. When I have 6x minus 9x, I get a negative 3x. Plus 3 equals 4x, and 24 minus 20 is a positive 4. I now have come to the point where I need to solve the equation. I see that I have x's on both sides. I must get them to one side. Remember, you always pick the smaller x and move it first. Therefore, I'm going to add 3x to both sides. And this results in 3 equals 7x plus 4. Now that x has been isolated to one side, you can get it alone. You start by doing order of operations backwards at this point by subtracting 4 from both sides. You then get 7x equals negative 1. Now I have something being multiplied by x, and the only way to get rid of it is to do the opposite and divide. 7 divided by 7 is 1, and 1x can be written as just x, equals negative 1 7. Remember in solving equations that include more than just the simple solving that you must distribute before combining like terms and both of those must be completed before solving the equation. Simply said, you must simplify before solving.